just like that, it is the week of Christmas. I hope that this Christmas season has been one of deep joy, rest, fun, and togetherness for you and your family. If I had to choose one word to explain my Christmas season, it would be anticipation. Throughout this Advent season, it's been brought to my heart that very rarely do I anticipate the work of the Lord. I'm very much a give me this day my daily bread and thank you Jesus for my daily bread type of gal. But during the season of Advent, I've been reminded to anticipate with joy and excitement what's to come, what the Lord is going to do next. Anticipate it. It also reminds me of O Holy Night and how the thrill of joy, right? The weary world rejoices. Man, I hope that this season has brought you closer to Jesus. I hope the thought of Jesus helps you to rejoice. And I'm curious to know if you could use one word to describe your Christmas season, what would it be? Talk to me in the comments. some ways our December rhythm and ritual has been the same this season and in other ways it's been completely different. We've been reading books and having slow breakfasts and being together and doing crafts but we've also had fun things this year like a Christmas play that Journey got to be in and we went on a marriage retreat and got to go to the beach in December and we have another trip coming up and we did Disney on ice so this December has felt the same but different we've been doing new experiences and that kind of all has been a way that God has been speaking to me about anticipation and how we need to be excited for new things excited for what's around the corner love and honor your traditions and your rituals but don't be afraid to anticipate new things so that's been a part of our december as well
closer and closer to Christmas Day, I hope you just can keep this in mind that it's not about the cookies and the shopping and the decorating. It truly is about Jesus and the anticipation that he alone gives us the thrill of hope, a hope so magnificent that the weary world rejoices. I hope you can rejoice this Christmas season knowing that Jesus is on the throne and that he is the greatest gift ever. Merry Christmas, ladies, and Happy New Year. Thank you.